Salam so, guys, this is the unboxing of TI Inspire CX CAS. Now, the TI Inspire line is the latest in its graphing calculator series. They have the CAS version and the non-CAS version. The CAS version is, stands for Computer Algebra System. And, the, and the, so the CAS versions are not allowed to use in use in like calculus classes or high school classes because they could do like advanced math stuff like integrate, indefinite integrals, derivatives. And the non-CAS version is basically a modern version of a TI-84. Um, so it does all the things like TI-84 does, a graph and equations. Um, so basically, since I'm in a higher engineering class, I got the CAS version. I got this on Amazon, and uh, it says Amazon with the only box that smile on its face. I still love that ad. Anyway, so it's already open, so sorry, I can show you the cutting. I mean, it wasn't open when it got here, but it has been open before I recorded this, so. Anyway, so I can show you the awesome sound of cutting tape and opening the magical little handles. So, here's what we have inside. This is the box where the calculator is. Now this is a color screen, like an iPad or an iPhone. Um, so you could put pictures and see graphs and color. This is a touchpad right here, so you could because this calculator has a mouse in there, a um, black mouse, so you could use a mouse to navigate um, the screen. And this is a keyboard right here. Uh, it's not corny, corny, so it's not in layout, laid out in the. Um, maybe I should come forward, right? <laughs> maybe it's not laid, laid out in. It's not laid out in the Q W Q U Q W R T keyboard. It's it's in the A B C D. So anyway, so this is the Texas Instrument TI Inspire C X CAS. C X is for color. This is a airbag. It has nothing inside or. Either that or it has an invisible cord. So I'm gonna say go with it's uh, nothing inside. There's more of these awesome and magical bags. Anyway, uh, there you go. And that's about it. <laughs> that's about it. Anyway, that's all the box has. Now I'm going to guess this is for protection, so you know it doesn't boom bump into it. But uh, let's we'll see. So this should have come with a cable. I think it's inside a uh, cable because this does not have double A batteries. This does not have triple A batteries. Basically, this is, has a battery like that, like your smartphone. Not replaceable. I mean, it is replaceable, but it's it's a fat like you know. Thin battery rather than circle uh, cylindrical AAA batteries, and uh, there, it has to, you have to plug it in, charge it every two weeks. Um, so let's just see, has some feature list. These are different versions. I'm on the second highest version. No, this is basically the highest version you could get. This is a T89. That's uh, a 1982 model. The titanium is an update for the T89 from 2005, I believe. But these are it does feature comparisons of things. So anyway. I'm gonna open this up, open this bad boy up, and then see what he got inside. Okay, um, so um, when I when I try to open this, I'm pretty sure I'll be destroying this packet. So let's see, it says cast color screen. What else does it say? Um, import images and USB connection cable. So let's see, open this up and see what's inside. If I can't open it like this, I'm gonna have to use scissors. But let's see if I. If I have brute force, there they go. <laughs> I think we're getting somewhere, right? Yeah. Okay, sorry. I'll try. Oh man, right? <laughs> there you go. in the process. Ooh, there's the power cord. Oh my god, we finally got another of these things that we lost on our way to New York. Anyway, so that's the, you basically plug in USB here, connect to the power cord, and we're done. Let's see what else we got. Inside, the 
we go. That is a quick start guide, I think. It's in it, inspired cast. Everything's in French. Maybe, maybe this is the English one. Yeah. Um, yeah, this is the handheld in the English one. So this is a quick start guide. Really big guide of introductions. Who reads the manual, right? Well, I'll keep it in case I don't know how to do something. I think the main manual is down side. There we go. There's that same comparison chart I pulled out from the back. There's the manual. No, this is the license agreement, US and Canada. Yeah, there's no check boxes, I agree. I just, they just assume if you buy this and use it, you agree to this. Um, there's the colorful manual with the lady using the calculator and the computer at the same time. And a seal. What does it say? Um, student software inside. So this is a, I think it's a trial. I'm not sure if it's a trial or if it's a. Uh, Okay. Anyway, charge handheld before prior to use. So they want me to charge this thing before I use it. So what we'll do is plug it in and turn it on at the same time. And do not discard. Okay. So I think I don't think it's a trial. I think it's a real thing. It's a software license number enclosed. So I might use it later. Um, there's a cable in there. I haven't got the calculator out yet, but there's the USB cable that I plug into this one. And let's see. Cardboard boxes. My well, cardboard box cuts actually. Cardboards, cardboards actually. Here it is. Calculator. Now this might look a little different than your other calculators because this is an LED screen. Very modern looking calculator. Very thin. Quite thin actually. It's actually also glossy, so you will get your fingerprints. So since since this is not a touch screen, I'll try not to touch it. But I'm worried I'll ruin it by fingerprints. Buttons feel nice, but I'll not turn it on yet. There's your typical calculator cover. That looks not like that, but looks like a typical Texas Instruments logo, as you see with other graphing calculators. This one, yeah. yeah I mean, it, it feels nice. It's a very not rough, it's not smooth, but it's very nice plastic feel to it. It's solid. It looks like it, feel, it looks like TI-83, but a little thinner and uh, black and sleek. There you go. And there's the USB port. This is the USB port right here, and this is the, I think, another port. I don't think they included it. I think this is the only thing I got. No, they did include it. Okay. So this is this other port. Uh, yeah, this is the small USB to mini USB to mini USB port. So you could connect two different calculators and get share apps between them. But yeah, there's the all this awesome stuff. So what you're gonna do now is try to turn it on and see what we get. The back of the cover, there's interesting glossiness here. I'm guessing that's for the screen. But uh, yeah, it closes very nicely. It's fun to open and close. I also like the. Ooh, what's this? Battery replacement. I'm not sure. Okay, so I plugged it in. I didn't even have to turn it on, and um, there you go. You could see it. But anyway, by the way, I plugged this in, and immediately, without wait, um, it showed the TI Inspire starting loading sign with the blue blue progress bar, and the busy sign. And this is the welcome screen. What does it say? Choose your language. Okay, so um, here we have choose your language. Okay, so let's see how you figure this out. Is there a screen? Oh, it's okay. For now, you use a keyboard here. English is fine. Okay. Enter. This is really hard to do. Um, choose font size. I'll go with medium for now because I don't know how many how big things will be. I could change it later in settings. Yeah. Make sure you put the back. Okay. Yes. The text next screen is the home screen to inspire hometailed. Okay, this is the home screen guys, so there's a nice black interface with 
stuff in there. You could do normal graphing, you could do awesome stuff. And there's your mouse cursor I was talking about. I don't know where it is. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's the mouse cursor as you can see here. There's, I'm moving the mouse here, so you see it? There you go, that's the mouse cursor. So it has a touchpad here. Pretty sweet. Now I could do some, there's my documents here. Pretty nice. There's a mouse moving. All I have to do is move my hand with this capacitive button place here, like the iPod Nano. And there's new document, my document settings. This calculate right here, so let's choose this. This is the normal calculator. You can see it. Let's do 2 plus 2, the legacy of mathematics. Plus two will be enter four. You can't see it, I know. I'm sorry. I'll try yeah, I can't show it to you, but you have to trust me on this. It's pretty cool. You could write fractions. It basically, it has math print, like you know, real textbook like re equations. So you write square roots, integrals, uh, derivatives, uh, summations, everything. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Everything shows the natural signs of mathematics, like, you know, the integral sign and stuff. So there's no hidden code to write integral, for example. Um, so it's pretty sweet. I'm very excited. It has color screen. So, guys, thank you for watching. Asalaamu Alaikum. I'll see you, in the, see you in another unboxing video. By the way, next, next up, inshallah, I'm going to be doing the Xbox 360 wireless speed wheel unboxing. So check, check, take a look out for that. And, uh... Hope you have a nice day. This is the TI-80, not TI-89, TI-Inspire CX CAS unboxing and first boot observation here. So thank you for watching and have a great day. Assalamu alaikum.